right, boys and girls, and welcome to Gordon Guitar. We have Odessa here featuring Claude. This song is called To Be Yours. So, uh, nice song to play. It's calm and very easy when it comes to playing here. No need for any capo. We have a couple chords and the same strumming that goes on in this song. So, let's start this one up. Let's take a look at the chords. So, we have first C. This is one of the five chords we need. So C is played third on A, second on D, open G, first on B, and open E. Next one is the D minor seven. So that is open D, second G, first B, and first E. And I bar the last two strings there with my index finger, the B and E string, just add the second on G. So that's a D minor seven. And then we have the E minor. So that is open E, second A, second D, open G, open B, and open E. We have F next, and that's a bar chord. So you place a bar on the first fret over all strings, and the rest will be third on A, third on D, and second on G. And the final is G. So that is third on E, second on A, open D, open G, third B, and third E. All right, so um, before we look at the different parts and chords, we will look at the strumming pattern. So C is the first chord. Let's take that one, and one strumming around will be down, 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 up. So uh, with a faster tempo there, standard tempo, it sounds like this, a couple of rounds. All right, and I like to play the first two downs more on the bass strings and the last down, down up more on the mid top strings down here. All right, so that's just my way of playing it. Let's take a look at the first verse. It's very, very easy. You're gonna go with two strumming rounds for C and two strumming rounds for D minor. That you will alternate for four rounds. So C2, D minor, seven for two rounds, and that you will do for four rounds. Let's take two rounds together, All right? So there you have the first four rounds, and that leads us to the first pre-chorus. I've known you so much longer. That's where we are in the lyrics, all right? So we'll play, continue the same way playing there, the C2 and D minor 7. We're going to play that for three rounds this time. And then on the fourth round, so to speak, you will play uh, the E minor. Um, for two rounds and then on this first pre-chorus you just play one down on F. So C2, D minor 7 for three rounds and then on the final round, the fourth round, you're gonna play E minor 2 and F1 down. Let's take C, D minor, F, sorry, C, D minor, E minor and F. kind of the ending the second half of the first pre-chorus and that takes us to the chorus all right so now um, I think I can uh, speak me while I'm playing here actually and take you through this so we'll start with a minor and I'm just gonna mention the chords it's uh, in this song like this that you're gonna play two strong rounds per chord Wherever you are, it's two strong rounds per chord. So I'm just gonna mention the chords. Let's go from A minor. E minor. F. D minor. A minor. E minor. 
F and G. And that is your chord. So A minor, E minor, F, D minor, A minor, E minor, F, and G. So it repeats itself except from the last chord, D minor in the first round, G in the second. All right, so then the post chorus is played in the same way as the verse, uh, only for three rounds. So C, two, D minor seven times three. So that is your post chorus. Uh, all right, so from now on, it's pretty much repetition. The second verse is played in the same way as the first one, and the same goes with the second pre-chorus, and uh, the second chorus as well. So it's just, uh, one down on the second chorus, uh, but it's the same chord progression. You're just gonna play one down per chord there. All right, so nothing changes there. Then we have the uh, second post chorus, uh, also played in the same way. And the final part is an outro part, okay? So this outro part is built upon two different parts, so to speak. So the first half of this outro is that you're gonna play one chorus play. Okay, so one chorus play in the first uh, half of this outro part, and the second half of it will be that you play one verse. So four rounds of the C and D minor seven. So that, if you build that together, one chorus and one verse, that will be your outro. And that will be to be yours. Uh, so uh, yeah that pretty much covers it so i hope you enjoyed it and if it was helpful please let me know thumb up subscribe if you haven't yet of course and yeah play tune